G'day and welcome back to another gas walkthrough. Today we're looking at Jan 26, 2025's Double Arrow Sudoku by Clover. Clover's one of our sides here at Gas HQ, so my name is Bill Murphy. G'day, how you doing? Um, I hope you are doing well. Um, this one should be a little bit of a breeze for you because uh, this kind of is. Um, I've been told that I ruined a few people's days. Uh, they didn't believe me. I did this puzzle in two minutes and four while I was testing it. Um, but uh, yeah, that's that's the time to beat. Tell you what, you get a bonus hat if you can beat my time of 2.04. Uh, drop, your, drop your hat times in the comments. Uh, we are gas, genuinely approachable Sudoku. We create set and solve genuinely approachable Sudoku for you, the person watching this. You'll find the link to today's puzzle in the description down below. You'll also find hat times. Two hats is for a very fast time, one hat is for a pretty fast time, and everyone gets a dinosaur because we love you all equally. <coughs> Pardon me. Um, that being said, I'm going to get into it. So, this is a double arrow Sudoku. So, normal Sudoku rules apply. Uh, each box, each row, and each column must contain the digits 1 to 9 once each. Now, uh, this, this, these look like between lines, which we've had on the channel uh, before, um, but they're not. So, be very, very careful. Uh, now, how does it work? Uh, whatever the sum in the uh, digits in between the lines is, uh, so here one and five would make six, mean that these three digits also have to sum to six. The sum of the digits on each line equals the sum of the two digits in the circles at the end of each line. That's it. That's all you need to know to solve today's puzzle. Uh, that being said, I'm going to go for it now. Um, let's do it. Now, I'm not going to try and do it as fast as I did it when I was test solving this, but I do know that this is a one, two, three, triple, because th the lowest you can have three digits B that sum to uh, six is that. Now, uh, what is this digit? Uh, because five plus the lowest this can be is four is nine, so that has to be nine and four. Now, uh, this has to equal, this, these two digits have to equal 13, so that's 6 and 7, meaning this must be 8. Now, this is 1 and 5, meaning this has to sum to 2 and 4, meaning this cell can't be 2, so it has to go that way. Now, we can do the exact same thing in the reverse direction. We know that this is a 1, 2, 3 triple. Uh, 2 puts the 2 here, this is 3 and 1 because of the 1 up here. Now, uh, if what's this digit has to be nine and five because the lowest this digit can be is five and this has to be a single cell digit. So uh, what is this uh, because it has to sum to fifth, uh, 14, it must be six and eight. Eight up here tells us which way around it goes, six and eight. This is seven, four and two make six. Uh, but because I can't repeat the 4 and 2, it means that this 1 tells me that this 5 and 1 go this way. Now, these two cells sum to 5. Uh, 1, 2, and 4, seeing this cell mean that this has to be 3 and then 2. We can actually unwind that cell. That's an 8. Uh, this is 3 and 5. Uh, now, over here, this is uh, 3 and 7, but we know that this can't be that. The seven can't go in that cell, so that has to be three and four. Uh, now, what else do I know? Um, bah, 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 bah. This is a five. Uh, well, yeah, five goes here, nine there, seven and six. Uh, I could probably do the same down here, I feel like. Uh, it's, oy, 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 that's a four. Uh, six, eight, nine, I can't quite do it. Uh, so that's one, that's three, though. Um... All right, so let's have a look in the middle. Yeah, that's a nine. Uh, this is three and six. Oh, that's fine. I can't actually quite finish off the sentence just yet. Never mind. Uh, six and nine over here. Uh, do I know what this is? It can't be two, seven, can't be four, five. Uh, it had to be either one, eight, or three, six. Oh, it can't be one, eight, because those one and eight both see this cell, so it has to be three and six. Uh, meaning this is six, eight, and nine. Uh, five and six, uh, seven and nine. I do know which way around that goes. I'm just going to do a considerable amount of damage. Uh, five and six. 
happening. This is one and five. And I know which way around that goes. Cool. Three, six, three, six. Uh, four and two. And now we're just doing some regular Sudoku. I mean, I should know that that's a three and a six. Uh, and that's a seven. Two, eight, and four. And this is eight, uh, seven, and five. So even talking through this puzzle, I did it in 419. Oh, I should have waited one more second. Dang it. All right. Uh, wherever you are, uh, this has been Double Hour Sudoku by Clover. Uh, my name's still Bill Murphy. Wherever you are in the world, I hope you have a fantastic rest of your day or night or whatever. I can't believe I've got my point self to a point in life where I have to do these before I go to bed. Um, but wherever you are in the world, I hope you have a fantastic rest of your whatever. And I'll catch you next time. Cheers. Bye.